Alright. Well, you see... Hmm. Don't ask me how, but I've met Albert already. He definitely is a shark. But his interest in all things maritime will be helpful. Hmm. Such as the boat upgrades he sells at an, at an outrageously high price. With those, you'll be able to cross ominous warrior... Warrior? Weather barriers in the world. They look like classical... Wow, I can't read today, guys. They look like classic mythical challenges again. A bit cliche, if you ask me. Hmm. You know, I'm delighted that you're here with me. But I'm not surprised one bit. It adds up. You here, taking care of me in my final hours. You've always cared so damn much about others. Always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pedantic snobs like me. Remember the day my father yelled at the cat? Mm -hmm. We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Mm -hmm. Father turned red and smashed the purple Delano vase. Okay, I don't know what's happening outside, guys. Whoa, okay, what kind of demon jellyfish is this? It was rad. Here we are. Yeah? You wanna eat this? Here we are. Damn. Here they come. Remember, say your eyes on the ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get glims anyway. I will wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out there. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. What? What do I do? Oh, it's coming. Yo, what do I do? Do I just get them? Okay. So I just jump into them, gotcha fam. Easy enough. Come on, come on, come on. Whoop. I can't reach the ones higher up. Hang on, hang on. There's so many. Wait! Wait on! Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, nuts. Oh, nuts. Yeah, we've got a lot, though. I want the big one. Hang on! No! Yes, I got it. Alright. Come on. Oh, why are there so many? My first question is, actually... Why are these jellyfish flying? I want the green one! Mm. Crap, crap, crap. Get back on the boat. Crap, get back on the boat. <laughs> get back on the boat! Okay, well, that's a whole pack of them coming through. But if this was real life, it'd be absolutely terrifying. Maybe they're spirit jellyfish. That would make sense, right? Okay, we got some bright jelly. So the bright jelly is green. Uh, is that correct? From what I've seen? Do I have enough? I guess I do. Fantastic! Okay. I'm really impressed. You rocked out there. Tumbling and diving like a shooting star. Without the slightest fear nor hesitation at that. You definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently waiting, mm -hmm. slowly digesting myself. All right, buddy. All right. <laughs> okay. I will make you some jellyfish food. Give me a second. All right, build kitchen, build. Okay, excellent. You're going to go right next to the guest house. Yes. Beautiful. All right, now let's go. Do I have to cook? Or like, does she make her own meals? Oh, sorry. Lovely kitchen. You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. What does jellyfish taste like? I have no idea. You could even say, uh, you could even try these loose corn kernels that have been hanging around my pockets. Ew. What? <laughs> you what? You've had corn kernels in your pockets? To make popcorn? 
Okay. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. Oh my god. If somebody gave me some loose corn kernels from their pockets, I would not want to eat it. But anyway. Okay, cook. Yosh. Huh? I thought she was gonna eat the freaking jellyfish. But we just needed the jellyfish to build the kitchen? Okay. All right, I'm just gonna accept it. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, guys. Cook. Cook it. Just cook three. Yep. Cook. Why is it so hot in here? <laughs> Why is everything like... Oh, done. Wow! Popcorn! Some of those are burnt. I can smell it. I could go for some popcorn right now. I can smell it. I could eat anything. Just give me some food. Ah, oh, calm down, calm down. Alright, give. Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I thought it could be. But, the <laughs> but then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Don't forget, spirits don't run in sunshine and water. We need a good meal once in a while. It will be up to you to understand who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure you remember I've always loved comfort food. And that I would die for a cup of coffee. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Just never the same thing twice. Ah, oh, and before I forget, here is something I was supposed to give you. I'm not sure exactly how it works, but an obol is a symbol of passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay you. But something tells me you knew that already. Oh. Did I? Don't think so. Okay, let's keep on improving this craft. As you must have seen, in your blueprint table there is both a field and a garden blueprint. Mm. Which means you can grow many different things. And turn this ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first in my opinion. Mm. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it around here and you can grow linen in it. Which in turn will be a will be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to use in it. But that will come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called Mozatine Mozatin Cove. And there is something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. Okie dokie. Uh, one second. So, garden and field, so we need some maple logs, limestone, lightning in a bottle. How do I obtain that? Alright. Just wanted to check what I needed. Yes, my dear. Ah, yes. I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your Everlight being, well, light. Or some other technicality. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want, tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck under the stars. I'd suggest you go to sleep too, in that cozy little room atop your cabin. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go, and this ship will, will start up again in the morning. Ah, oh, and speaking of that, you know me, waking up on time has never been my forte. You can ring that big bell over there to wake people up. Remember. Only do it at the right time. Mm. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Mm. Have a good night. Good night, my love. Okay, so I can go to bed. Or I can continue fishing. But I think we're fine on fish right now, so we're just going to sleep. Good night. Cute. Oh, good night, everybody. Ah, good morning.
burning. Ugh, stretchy, stretchy. Oh man, okay. So she said, wake her up in the early morning. I'll let her sleep in for a little bit. Let the sun shine. Do some fishing. So Gwen loves comfort food. Would she appreciate some fish? I think she would, because she also said she's not a picky eater. I could give her some more popcorn, because popcorn isn't... Oh, but then, yeah. Popcorn isn't really a full meal. I'll try giving her some fish and see what she says. I am curious. Okay, early morning. I'm going to wake her up. Time to get up! Good morning, Stella. Good morning, my love. Have some more popcorn. Oh, yeah, okay. Wow. Alright, I'm sorry. Jeez, man. These these spirits. Are, she said she wasn't picky. And then she's like, oh, I can't eat the same thing twice. Okay, dude. Have some herring. Goodness me. No, but it's like, I don't know, but for me personally, if somebody was giving me food for free, I would not complain. And if they were taking the time out of their day just to cook for me, I would eat it regardless of what it was. Gwen. <clears throat> just a bit salty. Can I give her a hug again? Are you in a good mood? Alright, alright, alright. She's a bit of a diva. It's fine. Some freshly cooked herring. Just for you. Eat it. What? Hello? Hang on, what? I just get- I just cooked it. Why can't I- what? I just cooked it. Why can't I give it to her? What? Alright, well, if I can't give a fish, I'll have to find something else for her again. That's fine, what if I just kill the seagull? Hmm? Fresh seagull? Probably tastes like chicken. Yeah, why can't I? Okay, fine, fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Let's figure this out. It's okay, it's okay. Excuse me, bird. Let me get this empty shell. Thank you. Okay. What are we doing? We are going to the cove and building a field. Okay, uh, not that. My goodness me. Going to the map. Yes, where is the cove? Ah, uh, new, yes. Off we go! So when do we start getting new spirits coming in? Is it only one at a time? Or can I get multiple at once? Hmm, hmm, hmm. I guess we'll see. Do some more fishing. I really wish they added more fish to this game. It'd be great to have more variety. I don't know, maybe later on? But we'll see. It's just herring. <sighs> okay. I don't want more herring. Well, well. I've got that weird feeling. I'm actually rather hungry. Yeah, I know, but you don't want to eat herring. And you don't want popcorn. What? What? I thought you liked popcorn, and now you're like, oh, I can't eat it again. 
I can't have the same meal two times in a row. Bruh. Alright, fine. Okay, we'll find something else. On this island that we are going to. Look at that! I still don't know how to pronounce that. Mostine? Mostine? Cove discovered. I'm gonna call it Mossy Cove. We're here at Mossy Cove. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Uh huh. Let us go. Oh, is she coming with me? No, she's not. Bye! What's all this? Oh, she did come with me. What is that? Bottles. Okay. Here we go. What a majestic tree! Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine, I promise. Are you sure? It's the best way to get the wood you need, actually. But don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. Okay. Oh, there's some berries! Yo, we can pick those berries. Maybe I can give her those berries to eat. My cat is adorable. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> Come on. Chop, 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 chop. Timber! Ooh, wow, well done. Yeah, I want these berries. Thank you. Raspberries. Delicious. Okay. Will you eat this? Congratulations! For you have become death, the destroyer of worlds. Joke aside, that's how you do it. Oh, she's the one who told me to do it. You go on ahead, cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to the boat and build the field with all those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Yeah, okay. Let me to do all the hard work. That's fine. That's fine, Gwen. I see how it is. My goodness. Yo, is this okay? We're literally just chopping trees. Does this count as deforestation? Timber! It's over here. Whoop. There you go. The more berries. Oh, what's here? Hold squares on this possible. Okay. Oh, what? What'd you do? Oh, okay, I held it too long. Gotcha. There we go. Beautiful. More limestone. Can I do? Is there more? I guess not. Okay. Let's keep going. There's nothing else. Really? Alright, back to the raft we go. Is that seriously it? Is there anything in the water? Nope. Okay. Yeah, we could totally give us those um, raspberries. Raspberry smoothie? Would you like that? Would you like some raspberries? Snack and healthy. There you go. Hmm. No, so... Are you joking? Gwen, why are you so picky? You know I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I've tried, but I just can't. What do you mean you just can't? Alright, fine. Starve. Completely fine with me. What does she eat? What does she eat? There's nothing else. Fine, okay, we're going. Oh, Gwen. Gwen, 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 Gwen. What am I going to do with you? Hmm. 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 What if I cook it? What will happen? It's still going to be fruit, so she's not going to eat it, right? I don't know if that was a good idea. 
Was that a good idea? I have no idea. Uh, normally, putting raspberries in the oven seems like a really bad idea. But hey, it's a video game, so let's see what happens. Oh, my cat is so cute. Look at my cat. She's so adorable. My cat is so cute. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And cooked. Thank you. Aha, poached fruit. Will she eat that? It's still technically fruit, but I mean, I got nothing else, so I don't know what you want me to do here. I don't know what you want me to do, Gwen. Let's try. Please. Hmm. No. Oh my goodness. All right. So any kind of fruit. Okay, babe. I'm sorry. Goodness. Okay, I guess we have to go somewhere else then. Aha. Uh -huh. More islands. Oh, what's that? Is that a town? <gasps> Hummingbird. Ooh, they sell a bunch of seeds. We could go there. Hang on, I want to check this place out first. Yes. Go, go, go. And then after that, we'll go to that little town, Hummingbird. Oh, this game is so relaxing. I love it. I'm really enjoying this so far, guys. I hope you are too. Because it's just so different to Fall Guys. Fall Guys stresses me. <laughs> if you've seen my other videos on my channel, it's just me stressing out over Fall Guys. So Spirit Fera is a nice change of pace. Oh, it's gonna be sundown soon. Oop! Hold on, hold on, hold on. We fit something. Hang on. Let me go scavenge. Aha, what's this? Yes, excellent. Coffee beans. Carrot seeds. Oh, I can... Once we get the garden and the field, we can plant those. Okay, continue on. Almost there. Let me fish some more. Okay, it's night time. I guess we have to go to bed. Oh, not yet. Still too early. All right. Uh, oh, there we go. It worked that time. So I think maybe just once a day I can hug my cat. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Is there anything else I can build? In the meantime? Um, nope. Oh, we need to get more bright jellies. Okay. Lightning in a bottle. Alright. I guess I'll just wait for bedtime. Okay, calling for an official water break, everybody. Please grab your nearest beverage and take a sip. <sighs> Refreshing. Oh man. Why is this taking so long? Can we go to bed now? Yes. Sleep until morning. Good night, everybody.